Welcome back, Chapter 5, Distant Shores. Alright, so apparently we made it toward a town that has some light. So maybe we can disappear from these giant creatures. <laughs> They could hear the sound of a river. The girl hurried toward it. It was right there on the other side, but there's no bridge to reach it. Hamlet on the wall. <laughs> I actually just uh, listened to a podcast, um, This American Life where they featured uh, prisoners that were doing the play Hamlet. But Hamlet's like a really long play, so they only do like one act. And in the play, a swarm of critters jostled and jumped behind the gate, or the grating. In the play uh, Hamlet, uh, Hamlet's uncle kills his father and becomes a new king and marries his mother. So the play is like Hamlet is trying to decide whether he should kill his uncle or not. So I don't know how I'm supposed to get past this guy. Oh, I guess I open that. Where's a girl go? Well, I died, so... <laughs> So let's try this again, so maybe... Wait for the girl. <laughs> oh, maybe she has to do it first. Some parts of this game, you have to like wait for her to do things. All right, so now I'll turn this on. Now I don't know where I'm supposed to go here. <laughs> Just help her get down, maybe? No? And suddenly there it was again. Because it doesn't have anything better to do than bug us. Next to impossible to see where I am. <laughs> Hopefully, he doesn't catch her. I look like I'm like a Dark Souls. I'm about to invade somebody. <laughs> if he like grabs her, 
from that little opening just above the ladder <laughs> that's gonna be messed up. Oh man, now I have to go through it. Didn't think I would fall there. I thought I would go through the opening there. Is that gonna kill me? I pressed the jump button just in case. It seemed that the girl was unable to escape. There's no way that the two of them could open the gate unaided. Well, great. Well, I'll see you later. Private. gate have been destroyed by the giant beast. Will he destroy me? I don't know. Oh, this is not good. in here <laughs> do I have to go <laughs> might have to go back and get her no there she is all right <laughs> you ready all right <laughs> I don't know where the beast went Tell me I have to hide. Probably bust through this big gate over here. going to push her off <laughs> off into the water now. The giant beast began to push the car that the girl had climbed into. I was trying to get like into that little gated area. All right, do we really have to watch all this again? giant beast began to push the car that the car that the girl had climbed into. I'm an idiot. There was nothing he could do to stop the giant beast. I wasn't even paying attention to the car. 
Did he even push it that far? I was just hoping those things, those critters, weren't gonna kill me. Alright, she's gotta like hurry up. <laughs> um, what do we do here? A great bridge appeared before them. Okay, so now where to? Just forward? Beyond the circus, they could just make out the little house. Okay, and that, <laughs> they all seem like big buildings to me. Maybe it's her house? On they went towards their destination. And there's the ladder. I guess we had to use that at some point. Then we get chased back. Yep. Can't be that easy. I'm going first because <laughs> forget her. Good luck with those. Uh, hopefully they've like moved far enough down. Wait for her. Just this time, though. Well, that's blocked, I guess. little lighted up area over here. I can't push it by myself even though I can push other things. <laughs> and then there they saw it. A ladder reaching up out of the sewer. So we had to go down to the sewer. So that's not great. There would be more than just muddy water down there. surprised we don't get to like play as her for a little bit guess we have to do it at the same time You're soaking wet like the entire time. I don't know why you're shaking it off now. Now we'll have to figure out how to move those tires <laughs> and how those tires even get there in the first place. To find another way up, the two descended into the sewer. Cause that's always a good idea.
Oh great, now I can't <laughs> see the character at all. I'm doing amazing by the way. I know you can't see it, but yeah. Though they were not in sight. They would still get a fright. Uh, the scene of beasts was all around. The two of them continued carefully, quietly on their own way. Oh great, yeah, so now you see steps. Well, I'm gonna die here. Don't know how they didn't kill me there. Sure, that's like something, the circus, something. <laughs> the writing on the wall. The destination lay just outside the sewer. But we can't open this, probably. Oh, one gate that actually opens. Wow, surprising. There, they found a ladder leading to the street. But they wouldn't take it. They'd rather jump off into the water. The little house was visible beyond the circus tent. Yeah, that has to be her house, I guess. And upon seeing it, the girl began to run, hoping with all her heart that she could make it, I guess. Chapter 5, Distant Shores. Right, well, at least that chapter was a lot shorter than the previous one. Hey, we're finally at the circus, the night circus, chapter six. Yeah, there's, where are the people? Without so much as a glance at the circus, the girl rushed off toward the little house. The little house all aglow, there it was at last. The unknown did not notice the two of them. It was too busy trying to smash down the door. If the monster is supposed to be like her father or something, I'm gonna <laughs> be upset. But it could not get into the house. The girl guided the unbelieving boy. Hopefully we don't knock off that bottle there. The girl drew the creature's attention from behind the bars. And the unknown began to chase her. Oh, great. So now we go to the circus.
Into the circus they went, they disappeared into inside the tent. The girl ran as fast as her legs would carry her, all the while the unknown followed closely behind. like get that close to it. <laughs> I see the ladder there. Maybe I have to go all the way around. Desperately, the boys search for a way to reach the girl. Just going blind into this thing. <laughs> Hopefully, I'm near the ladder. This is a real blind playthrough. Unless you're actually blind. In which case, I don't, I'm not sure if Twitch will allow you to stream on it. Since they got rid of blind playthroughs. Girl was waiting for him at the bottom of the ladder. I was about to say, you figure that thing could just like jump over. Large cage hung over the circus ring. If only they could lower the cage. They might be able to trap the unknown. Alright, this is a long <laughs> taking a long time to set this up. Alright, I don't know. Guess we just use that first and I thought we had to go around like the other way, but apparently not. The two of them headed for the final lever. The first time I tried that, I thought like we had to do it at the same time. Unknown moved away from beneath the cage. So I'm gonna have to distract it and get it back over there, apparently. The girl tried bravely to draw the unknown's attention. He had to get down there and retrieve the doll. Alright. So like in all games, I'm going to do the majority of the work. doesn't like see me there <laughs> where 
is a doll. You need to find something to draw off the unknown. Last, the two of them had trapped the unknown. All right, I guess that's both of us. <laughs> means the game over right like that's it I doubt it <laughs> it's supposed to be like three hours I don't think it's maybe been an hour and a half maybe oh I'm on the bottom <laughs> they listen to the unknown's cries disappearing into the distance and return to the girl's home Door's locked, of course it is. But not a sound came from within the little lit up house. Nobody answered her call. Looking as if she might burst into tears at any moment, the girl continued to knock. So let's go back to the way we started this. <laughs> of course, she had to knock over the bottle and ruin it all. But at least we caught in the cage, I guess. I like that you even see the shadow reflection on the street below him. She stood still on the balcony. Before them was a little room. And there, lying on the bed, was the girl herself. She seemed to be suffering as she lay there. Her body shook gently. And as it did so, the invisible girl came gradually back into view. She knows that she was becoming visible again.
and just as her form was about to be fully restored, she stopped trying to wake herself. She turned to stare searchingly at the boy. Didn't know that was a word, searchingly. The darkness flooded in. Into the one place left in that world. The boy tried his hardest to open it, but the door would not budge. The creature had destroyed the house, and the light that had shone through was there no more. Yeah, I have no idea where I'm at. <laughs> Neither the girl's voice nor the unknown's could be heard. The boy was alone once more. It was still the little girl's home. But the lone light that had shone there had gone out. His head swam with thoughts of her, with memories. And the night closed in. The boy returned to the town and the night. A blackness darker even than the night swallowed all before him. Chapter 6, The Night Circus. Alright. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll end the video here. And uh, we'll see what happens next time. Bye, guys.